Snow avalanche danger changes season to season, month to month, and day to day. In other words, each day is different. Avalanche forecasters track snowpack and weather conditions and provide daily avalanche forecasts for many mountainous areas in the United States. Avalanche activity is controlled by the interaction of three complex factors, the terrain, the weather, and the snowpack. Whether you are new to the backcountry or a seasoned professional, the avalanche forecast aims to make this complex subject as easy to understand as possible. Mm. The information in the forecast begins with simple summary messaging and progresses to more detailed, specific information. The first and most basic component of the forecast is the bottom line. This is take-home messaging for everyone, regardless of avalanche knowledge. The bottom line gives you simple information about three basic avalanche questions. What is it? Where is it? And what should you do about it? Think of it as a soundbite or a summary of the most important information for the day. Next is the avalanche danger rating. The scale consists of five ascending levels. Your chance of encountering an avalanche increases dramatically with each level. Many avalanche forecasts provide danger ratings for three elevation bands. For example, in this view, the danger is rated at considerable at all elevation bands. And in this view, the danger is considerable in the upper band and moderate in the middle and lower band. For a more detailed tutorial on the avalanche danger scale, go here. Avalanche problems are an extension of the danger rating. Avalanches come in many shapes and sizes. Avalanche problems allow you to better visualize and understand the avalanches you may encounter. This section illustrates the type of avalanche, where that avalanche exists in the terrain, how likely you are to trigger it, and how big it will be. This set of graphics is often accompanied by written descriptions and media that help illustrate or explain it. For a more detailed tutorial on avalanche problems, go here. The forecast discussion is an important catch-all where forecasters may provide more specific information on the snowpack, avalanche cycles, complex conditions, or other interesting topics that dive deeper into the what is it, where is it, and what should you do about it questions. Lastly, a mountain weather section is included because it plays such a critical role in both avalanche formation and trip planning. This section provides a basic overview of both the recent weather and the weather you may encounter. Each day is different. The avalanche forecast is an important starting point in your winter planning process. You are in charge. You make the choice. Hmm. Visit avalanche.org to find the avalanche forecast for your area.